this. You know, how many times have you complained about traffic? <laughs> I know that is laughable, right? Well, maybe the Hampton Roads Bridge Tunnel is on the top of your list. Do you really live here if you don't complain about traffic? Well, now's your chance to give your uh, two cents to those who are trying to make a difference in the world of transportation. Let's hope they do their jobs. News 3's reporter Angela Bohan has details on a survey that organizers say can help shape the future of the Hampton Roads commute. Think about the year 2050. I know sometimes it's hard to even think about next week, but take a moment and think about what you would like your neighborhood, your city to look like nearly 30 years from now. We went to the streets to ask residents what they think. Times are changing and we need to uh, maintain with the time. So we need more. We need more of a mass transit. Nora Cowell agrees, saying there should be more bike lanes and more buses. I'm getting older, sweetie. And, uh, <laughs> I'm not going to be driving forever, you know what I'm saying? So by the time 30, 40 more years, I'm going to need somebody to take me, drive me around. Hopefully, these residents will take the time to fill out an online survey open now to everyone in Hampton Roads. Public input is extremely important to us. Um, we want to hear from residents of Hampton Roads so we can better understand where are issues, whether it be congestion or safety or maybe access. Anything that we can do to help improve the transportation system helps improve quality of life. And something that would improve the quality of life for this mom and her son is more covered bus stops like this one. For a child like my son, He's, in, he's considered an eloper. He could run and get hurt. So I think that more stand is needed. The online questionnaire is made mostly of multiple choice questions. It will ask various things like, what do you think are the top three transportation problems we see in Hampton Roads? And what does your neighborhood lack? And there will be another survey next year, but this one closes on October 31st, Halloween. And to get to that survey, find this story on our website, WTKR.com. In Norfolk, Angela Bohan, News 3.